if you want to make a simple pick a lily one way of doing so would be from your allotment you could have 200 grams of each of the following chopped and prepared here I've got an example coral rabbi there's cucumber courgette string beans or dwarf French also cauliflower the same and I've got here some shallots you could also use onions as well and there's the basic ingredients you've got to make a piccalilli your ingredients need to be chopped up into bite-sized pieces and here you can see the string beans courgettes and coal rabbi and on this side here the cucumber onions and cauliflower put all of your ingredients that's 200 grams of each into the bowl bowl and then sprinkle 50 grams of salt I'm using sea salt here uh, over it approximate mix in get the salt well mixed into your veg don't overdo it on the salt though with these although it does need some help with preserving after your vegetables have been left overnight with the salt on they need to be washed and drained other ingredients you'll need will be sugar ground ginger turmeric mustard powder mustard seeds corn flour cumin seeds and coriander seeds as I say the amounts will be given in the description for the recipe also apple cider vinegar one litre will be needed use some of your vinegar to mix in with the spices but not all of it at this stage making sure you stir very well and you've got your corn flour ready and add some corn flour keep mixing in make sure that your mixture is smooth and not lumpy eventually adding the ingredients in okay add your remaining vinegar to the sugar and it will have to be boiled and simmered keeping an eye on it while you're stirring vinegar and sugar have boiled now and the spices have now been added with the corn flour and mix in keeping on the boil you need to keep your eye on this once you've added the spices and the corn flour mixture into your vinegar then keep it on the simmer keep stirring to avoid it becoming lumpy once your spices and vinegar mixture and corn flour has been heated up sufficiently on simmering and it's thickened up it's time to turn the heat off and then to add your vegetables with of course the gas turned off you don't need to heat again basically now what you're doing is you're coating your vegetables with the spices vinegar and corn flour and sugar that you've mixed in so the idea is to get, get those vegetables a very good coating stirred in and you notice that a wooden spoon is used in this mixture rather than using anything metal so it doesn't add any flavours, any taste beyond what you want in your jars and of course your jars will need washing, cleaning, uh, sterilising and you can use lids if you have them once you've thoroughly mixed your vegetables into your spices and vinegar and corn flour it's time to put them into your jars 
this piccalilli is said to be suitable for eating once made but I would advise that you let it mature for around three weeks before you do heat it. Again if you have the correct sealing lids for these jars which came from you know pickling jars then you can just put them straight on and otherwise you can if you want to you can put cling film on first cut, cut a square of cling film to cover the, the jar lid and then put your clean lid on and these jars have been washed and sterilized before use. As a comparison here are some ones made earlier. The one on the left has got some dwarf beans in it. There's less vinegar in it. There's also carrot in it and no coal rabbi. The one on the right is the one made uh, just now with the coal rabbi in and it doesn't have carrots. And what you'll notice about the difference in the consistency of these two using different um, recipes is that the one on the right, the new one which I'm showing you now, has got more of the spices, corn flour and um, herbs per, you know, with, with so it gives a completely different consistency to this pickle lily. The, this one of course we're making now, we did say it could be eaten um, you know, fairly soon after m making, I still advise with these to to let them mature. The one on the, on the left has not been tr not been tried yet, and, and the date on that was the twenty uh, sixth of August. So we're still waiting on that 